All right, out here working on Old Blue. About to do a turbo swap on it. I've been running a S475 Borg Warner 132AR housing. And I'm going to switch over to a S, or not a S, a 7875 turbo and with the 96 housing. See how that works compared to this one. This one seems to work. It just might need something to spool up a little faster. This one's a little... A little slow or actually got to compare it with the with the other one see how it runs so Starting to rain. Alright, well, here's a size comparison. Got the 7875 versus S74 with a 132 housing versus a 96 housing. So I know I can make that spin. I just hope I don't make this spin too fast. But we'll see. I'm going to put it on there. Alright. Here we go. This one's so much lighter. The other one online says seven, or the S745 is a 54 pounds. And I just weighed this one. It's only 22 pounds. So, huge difference. Alright. So I got the little turbo on there. I say little because the way it's so much smaller than a 475. So this is supposed to be a 7875 for the 96 housing. So I just threw a little pipe on there, just extended it. So it's not pretty, but just to see what it'll do. I'm not, I'm not confident it'll really run that good because I'm so used to the one with the big, big housing and it flowed so good. But you know, I could be wrong. Ryan with the banana says that this will work a whole lot better. So hopefully he's right. So for 270 bucks, it's not too bad compared to the 475 was around $400. So but we'll go ahead and it's cold, start it up and see how it sounds compared to the to the big old big mama jamma turbo I had on there.
right, so we got it on there. It's not leaking anything. Sounds all right. So the next step is I just got to get it out there and do a little, a little driving on it and see how it feels. See if it. I'm sure it'll make you know boost a lot quicker. Just I'm worried about how it'll hold the top end. But other than that, we'll see how she does.
wasn't too bad. That's kind of exciting, actually. That thing rips pretty good. The only issue I noticed, my fuel pressure's dropping. I had that break up, so. Hope she wasn't going too lean. But that'd be the next thing to check. I mean, it's hard to see that little screen when you're blasting it. But I'll go back and check the log and see what I got to do. See what I got to do about that fuel pressure. Something I've been battling for a while. It just keeps dropping. I don't know if I went to too big of a line. Nah, we'll see what it says. We'll work on it and get it going. See if we can catch up with that banana. See you guys later.